Hello there guys and girls, this is Pixel and today I want to address something, obviously as I say many many times, I look at all my comments, I read all my comments, I try and stop myself from hearting the comments that say, if you see this comment, give it a heart, because I'm thinking, I know they only want to do it for the like, but then I think if someone sees that and it doesn't have a heart on it, they might think I don't read all the comments, but I do! So, I'm in a little bit of a crossroads there, but I get a lot of comments, a lot of uh, <laughs> slanderous comments, I guess you could say, about my rank, and this video is going to address my rank because either you haven't been on the channel for that long or you have an incredibly short memory or you just missed it but if we go to my ranks it's not it's not great, is it? Because we're in gold three. But I'm not a gold three player, okay? I did a video where I deranked two gold three to try 1v1s on keyboard and mouse. And I did beat a platinum player on keyboard and mouse. But the series felt a little bit dead. I was going to make it a series. It turned out a one-off video was good enough. But now my 1v1 rank is in the bin. And I wanted to do a video of me playing some more 1v1s and getting the rank up. And every single time I make a different video, like a rank twos or anything like that, people always slate me <laughs> for my 1v1 rank. I'm not that bad. Another thing that I wanted to address, if you've watched my Twitch stream or one of my recent videos, I said how essentially my car randomly front flips sometimes without me touching the controller and I confirm this theory, it's not dead zone, it's actually my controller because I was in a replay trying to get a screenshot and the camera just kept moving forward even though I wasn't touching the controller so my controller is, is just broken and I went on Amazon to order another one and the deliveries are taking forever so I don't know when I'll get a new one but at the moment I'm going to be randomly front flipping so I thought what better way to trigger me with that than play some 1v1s in this video so we're going to sit back and chill, as you can see I'm using the webcam today so it's going to be a, a longer relaxed video. I'll play two or three games not warmed up, but it's gold three. As I've said, I should be fine in gold three. So I'm going to give a shout out to the sponsor of the channel, Logger.com, because they've really, really helped me out throughout this awkward time period that we're in and for many years before that. And you guys love their service. I get a lot of comments from you, a lot saying you use their services and you really like it. So definitely go and check them out. And if you do want to buy something, use discount code Pixel. But if not, go and get yourself some food, some drink. We're going to chill and just play some 1v1s today and, and relax because I'm going crazy with the uploads. So today we're doing something a little bit more chill. This video is brought to you and made possible by Logger.com. So if you want to check them out, be sure to use the link in the description and use discount code PIXEL for 6% off your purchase. You can check out their gift cards, their credits, anything you like the look of on their site, you can go over there. And as I said, use the discount code to save yourself some money. Massive thank you to Logger for sponsoring the video and let's get on with it. All right, here we go. I was actually on a run this morning. It's about midday now, and I did my usual route, which is uh, about six and a half miles. Oh, that is the broken controller at its finest, because no problem, lad. You score those goals. As you can see, that's what I should have done. A half. Watch the replay. Why on earth would I double jump like that? I tell you what, I didn't. My thumb was down on the analog stick. It seems that the, that happens, similarly to when it makes me front flip automatically, um, basically, my controller thinks it, the analog stick is further up than it is. So when I'm pulling back down on it to do a backflip, it will actually think that it's not being touched at all. So it will therefore, you know, make me just jump in the air. Whereas when I'm doing, you know, I'm not holding back on the, the analog stick and it's just in the middle, it thinks it's higher up and therefore makes me do a, a front flip. That was just weird. I'm, I'm going to apologize for that. I meant to hit the ball and I just, I just whiffed it. I don't even know what happened there. So yeah, that, I think that, that actually, that's like a double whammy. That, that was very, very strange, but I guess I kind of faked him out in a way. So yeah, that's why when I try and backflip or usually I don't backflip for the sake of backflipping, usually it's just a half flip situation. That's why it just think it just makes me double jump because the amount that I pull back on the analog stick is cancelled out by how broken it is. And then similarly, that was kind of cool. Uh, similarly, when I try and just do a double jump, it makes me front flip because it adds a forward forward stick to the analog, if that makes any sense. So essentially, for like sometimes when I'm playing, it thinks that my analog stick is pushing up when it's not. So then when I push down, it thinks it's not going anywhere, so I sometimes mess up a half flip. And that is literally a controller issue. I always thought it was dead zone, but it's not because I was I was getting very angry yesterday. I was trying to get a thumbnail for the demo me for a black market video, and the camera just kept zooming forward at rapid pace, and I couldn't get the screenshot I needed, and I wasn't touching the controller. And obviously replay, you know, dead zones don't come into replay, to my knowledge, so that might be a goal, I don't know. Um, but luckily, it shouldn't matter too much, because I am a higher rank than this in terms of 
skill level. So even though we're not warmed up and the controller is fisting me a little bit, I did try and plug in my old black controller to see if that would work for the replay. And the computer said it was setting it up, but it didn't, it didn't want to actually work. So see there, I'm, I'm fully holding back on the analog stick. So at least I can, it's frustrating when I record, yes, but at least I know it's sort of not me. It's, you know, there's nothing I can really do about it until I get a new controller. So there's that. But anyway, as I was saying, before I kind of figured out what's actually wrong with my controller, um, this morning I went for a run and I actually got a nosebleed. I've had about three nosebleeds in the last week. I'd see there! I didn't front flip. I wanted to double jump, but it thinks my car, that's... Uh, you it's undeniable that look I my car was front flipping in the replay and I wasn't touching it it's a broken controller I can't I can't deal with it oh my goodness I wish there was some sort of controller it'd be really interesting actually you know those softwares that show people what buttons you're pressing I wonder if the software would detect me as holding forward on the analog even though I'm not because let's go to the wall it's gonna come back if off the corner that's a good read, I guess. Um, oh, anyway, back to the story. Okay, I was on a run. I got a nosebleed. I've had like three in the last day. And an old guy who told me he was actually an ex-first aider, which, you know, I guess is nice. Um, he gave me a couple wipes to help because I only had one bit of kitchen roll. Look at that. I'm holding back down on the analog so hard. It doesn't matter because this guy's given up. But it, this controller's getting worse and worse. It's just fully broken. What a finish. And then it works there. I just, I don't know what happened. Sometimes the, uh, when I've used the quick chat, I don't know what happened there. Sometimes when I've used the quick chat, it, um, it then makes my analog go funny if I press the arrow keys, but I don't know what it is. Well, he disconnected. I don't know what that was. It seems fine now, but I'm going to have to actually get on Amazon. I'm going to do it on my phone right now. Let's, sh let's do the internet. Let's show the powers of the internet because I didn't order a, a, a PlayStation controller yesterday because the uh, delivery was too long. It was like, uh, yeah, it was a week. But you know what? I need one. PS4 controllers. See, there's a Prime one, but it's just not the right one. It just is all wrong. So I'm going to have to go for the basic black PS4. Only 11 left in stock. Okay, at least they're back in stock. They weren't... I don't think they were in stock yesterday. 60 quid. Is that how much they cost? Used good. A used controller is 60 quid. I mean... Oh, screw it. No, I can, can I justify that? I genuinely don't know. This says Prime. Red. Proceed to check out. Does that mean I'm going to get it tomorrow? Yes. Okay. I'm going to get a red controller. I've tried black. It was very good to me for, for many, many years. I tried gold for a couple of months and it's screwed me over. Let's go with red. Tomorrow. Yes. Let's go. Buy now. £65. I don't know if that's good. But it sounds a lot. And that's the power of the internet. By the time this video goes up, I'll have that controller. So it's going to be great to actually be able to play Rocket League and not have these problems. Because you guys probably get sick of hearing it. Whilst I'm not lying, you probably think, okay, you've told us. We get it. Get over it. But it's just annoying in the moment when you might be watching this. You can't see what I'm doing on the controller. I clearly whiff. But it's, it's not actually me. And not, it's easy to say that like sometimes if you've got a fully working controller and it is your fault, you can just say, oh, lag or whatever. And you can sort of make excuses. But when your controller is actively doing things that you're not doing, and there's a correlation between my front flips when I want to double jump and my lack of back flips when I want to half flip, it's like, it's clear that my analog is, is not, not correct. But either way, we're in a 1v1 game. Thor's going up for crazy little aerials. Let's just try and get over it. Pop it down. I've got no flip reset. That's annoying. I really thought I had... If I had a flip reset, I would have scored. But he's going to hit that wide, right? Oh, no. Can we get this boost? No! How on earth? Good pinch, though. I can't believe he got that boost. I was right there. You don't always need boost in ones. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Here we go. All right. Oh, we're from Thor. Demo, 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 demo. Or a bump. Bumped him straight onto the ball. There we go. We, we're toyed with him a little bit. I should be winning these games. I should get to platinum. And then when I get a new controller, we can uh, we can play properly because, I yeah, luck at so far this game, no interruptions, nothing crazy. But there were a couple, there was one goal in particular last game where, where we conceded purely because of that. And also in my in my rank 2v2 video I did with final footage, um, game changing whiff from me and net where my car just pitched forward when I was in the air. 
when it shouldn't have done. Let's try and get a block. He missed it. That's a goal. <laughs> I was just trying to dunk his clearance, but there we go. Nice shot. Thank you, lad. People seem quite nice in this rank. Golds. I guess when it gets a late platinum diamond, it starts to get toxic. And then also in champ three, it's very, very toxic because there's that sort of complex where people think they should be in grand champ when they clearly shouldn't be. Um, you're guilty at times. I did feel it a little bit there, my car pulling forward, but nothing crazy. Oh, what a shot. But here, both opponents, when I've scored a pretty decent, well, an okay goal, but decent for the rank I'm at, both opponents have said, nice shot. Oh, good save as well. I like that. Yeah, so maybe this is the wholesome sort of Rocket League I need. Right, let's see if we can half flip. Again! Look at that! I, this is the thing. I pride myself on my consistency of my half flips. I actually put it to the test there, and my half flip was, in fact, denied. It's annoying because half flips are so crucial. That's unfortunate. For getting back to defend, for changing a, a clearance into an attack. If you're backwards and the ball's hit towards you and you can clear it with a back flip, but then follow it up with a half flip to then go on the attack, it's a game changer. It really, really is. And now I can't rely on my half flips, which is a little bit frustrating. Let's try Mognus flick. Nah, that was like a mini Mognus and I still hit it over the bar. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, I don't get the mechanics of that. I don't get how to flip off the wall. Get this boost. He's startled. We got a dunk. Wait for the ball. Oh my goodness! I think I think that was me. I think I let go of pushing forward on the analog too soon there. I'll, I'll take the L on that one. Good touch. Oh, I've hit it wide. It, oh, but this should be an easy enough game. This is just a, a 1v1 ranked situation video where I don't have to... That was a bit strange. I think that was also my fault. Uh, well, I don't have to stress too hard because I am a bit below my sort of threshold because of the D rank situation. Woo! Oh, here we go. I landed a little bit weirder than I thought there, but there we go. This guy's not bad. Oh, really thought I was going to hit that, but we move. Big boomer. Nah, I'll let him go. Oh, Thor did the same. We think alike. Have a go, Thor. Oh, here we go. I used a single jump aerial because I wasn't sure if he was going to go below me or above me because he didn't seem too keen on taking it all the way to the top bin. Cut back. Oh, I, I can't keep that down. There we go. We got it in anyway. 4-0. I wonder if he'll forfeit. I don't know. I know I know. This it's not the most competitive video, but I, I've got to do it to get back. What are you doing all the way down here, bro? Uh, yeah, it was... Um, uh, yeah, I feel a little bit bad, but at the same time, I've kind of got to get back up to where I belong. Sorry, man. I deranked for a video and need to get back. Ah, uh, see, it's, it's difficult because it's kind of like smurfing, but it's also kind of not because what choice do I have? Big fan! Hey, that's dope. That's so sick. I don't know if he knows who I am because it took for me to say I was making a video for him to say big fan, and maybe that then twigged in his mind. He recognized my name, perhaps, but yeah. Which means he probably won't forfeit because he wants to stick around. But, um, yeah, I appreciate that. Thank you, Thor. Much love. Like, because part of me would want to just forfeit and let him win. But then it just means I have to beat someone else. You know what I mean? Oh, I really thought I didn't, had a flip reset there. Good control. Nice goal. Nice one. Can't even put it in. Appreciate that, man. All right. I think this game, this game has run its natural course. I think I'll finish it. Maybe chat with him. Maybe get promoted to Platinum. I'm not sure. Then I'll do one more game and see if it becomes any more competitive or if we still have a little bit more to go. So, yeah. I'll see you in a minute. Oh, this guy said shocked I get to play you. That's so cool. Now he gets the chance because of my little video experiment. And he's he's not... Oh, I was going to say, if he went for that kickoff goal, he wouldn't be out of the game completely. But he is now. All right. Well played, man. Good to see you, Thor. Let's get into the third game. Is that promotion? I don't know. Possibly. Another white blade wave. Jeez. And we're in platinum one. All right. We're getting our way back up. Let's play another game. See if, if we can have a competitive platinum one game. Nice to meet you. There we go. Good luck, man. Thank you. Wholesome Rocket League moments, everybody. Hey, let's go. Here we go. Game number three, platinum. Maybe we're finally starting to get to the toxic ranks. Denbo RL. Don't know what division he's in. Probably high platinum one with that that score. Let's see how this goes. Oh, got a little flip on the kickoff. I see you. Oh, okay. I thought my car was... Yep, my car is pitching forward a little bit. All right. Didn't expect me to go for that. Nice one. Nice one. Here we go. 
I did not trust my controller to do the right thing there, but it actually did. Um, I wanted to touch that with my nose, but I couldn't. I wanted it to be like a pre-flip, but my nose just didn't catch it. So here we go. What? Don't know how he just got past me there for a second. All right, here we go. Let's let's score a goal. Bang. This is going to be very tough for him to defend. That's a goal. One nil. Here we go, boys. Come on. I see. Here's the thing. On my day with a working controller for sure. Like on a really good day, I'm a champ ones one, champ one ones player. And on a good day with a teammate who's my level on a good day, I'm a low GC in twos and certainly in threes. Um. But on my average day, I'm like a low C3 in twos, which is basically where I'm at. And I'm a C3 in, in threes because, you know, that, and that's that's where I'm at because that's what I have most consistently. I don't have good days all the time. That was a really nice little doink we did, though. And that is 2-0. Come on the pick. But uh, yeah, Platinum 1 definitely is in my ones rank. Real. Yes. Yo. Everyone knows who I am. It's crazy. <laughs> Absolutely crazy. What's up, Denbo? Hope you're having a good day. Maybe you guys could go uh, check Google or YouTube Denbo RL or Twitter or something and see if he's, you know, anywhere on the internet, if he's about it. He missed the boost, which is not ideal. Can get this one, though. He's done that, and he's set me up, and that is why. Because I'm bad at the game. So there we go, 2-0. Uh, I'm taking it much too casual. Can we get that angle? No, we can't. Maybe we could go in the corner. He's not going to give us that sort of time. Decent dunk. Got absolutely crushed. In a bit, Denbo. <laughs> That's 3-0 at 333. I definitely think I need to win a few more games. Maybe start a Diamond 1 again. But I don't know if I want to do a proper 1v1 series. I think I just wanted to address the concerns uh, with my rank. A lot of people really care about rank. Um, me, I, I care a little bit. Part, it's partly it is just like keeping up appearances. Because although, to, for the most part, I don't care what people think. It's annoying to get judged based on your rank. Um, it, it is just annoying because people have this opinion of you when they don't know you. If you watch my Twitch streams, you get a pretty good gauge on how I play for the most part. And it is usually better than I play in videos because for a Twitch stream, you've got at least a couple of hours of, of gameplay. For a video, you might get 20 minutes. So if I have a bad day, oh, backboard. Oh, I didn't even hit it right. If I have a bad day, then I'm garbage at the game, obviously. But on Twitch... For the most part, in two hours, even if I'm having a bad day, you can see glimpses of, of what we're about. Bang, there we go. Let's get this boost. Oh, he didn't want that. He didn't want the smoke. 5-0, 254. I think this is over. This has been, it's been, it's kind of been like an unranked ranked video. It's been kind of relaxed. Let's try a fast kickoff. Oh, we got it. Oh, I bottled it. It's kind of frustrating. I didn't really get close enough. I, I did all that wrong, basically. I didn't hit the ball hard enough on the kickoff. I had to hit it really fine to get it round him. Let's put it to the right. Keep it keep it cool, calm and collected. It's going to go off the backboard, maybe? Oh, here we go. Oh, I bottled it. However, we can get this boost. Maybe just flick it out in the middle. It's already come off the wall a little bit. Flick now. Didn't get the height I wanted. Let's take it back with us. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I'm taking it way too casual. In fairness, I didn't think the ball would go on the top of the back of my car. Because when it's on the back, if you drive forward, you kind of lose the ball. I thought it would be on the front of my car so I could drive it forward with me. But if you drive forward and it's on the back, it would just fall off. And he would have scored without me being there. So just a slight uh, error there from me. I have time for this boost. Don't think he's going to convert. Especially not if I do that. That is very savage. I'm very sorry. Out of boost, though, pretty much. No, I missed him. <laughs> Good save. You should put this away. Oh, I might be able to get back. Took a second. Faked me out. Oh, I missed the boost. I can't believe he scored that. Oh, that is so bad for me. I See, I was ready for his fake. I just missed the ball. Like I think I was expecting to fake it. I just literally, like, you saw my, I hit the ball, but the ball didn't move. So I just didn't. I didn't move my car enough to where the ball was. So now I have to take it a little more seriously, I guess. Nice flick. Tough to deal with. Well dealt with in the end. But very unfortunate bounce off the wall. It was either going to roll down straight to me and I could have just chipped it in. Or it was going to bounce up and it would have been an aerial. But still, 
6-2. Let me know what you guys think of these videos, because I know they are easier to make. I know they're not blockbuster videos. I know this video is going to be probably my least viewed video of the last month. But sometimes I think it's good for my sanity to just chill and actually play the game. And I know, for the most part, people don't... Not people in general, but some people, a lot of people that watch my usual banger videos don't really care about some people don't even care about ranked gameplay from anyone but especially from me you know what i mean and especially in platinum one but i know some of you do care and that is shown by the love and support on the twitch streams and everything like that so just let me know just, just drop a comment and everything like that he said gg so i'm guessing that means he wants to go and play someone else it does uh but yeah thank you dembo i appreciate that we'll probably be in maybe platinum one div two but i'll probably get up the ranks when I decide to play some more ones. But that is going to do it for this video. If you did enjoy it, it was something chilled and relaxed. Leave a like. Subscribe today to join the Pixel Army. I've been Pixel. You've been awesome. I'll see you in the next video very soon.